here all week long. It's a shock to your senses getting out of here. It's a city. I think I like it out there in the farmland. <laughs> a lot better than the city. So um, I'm doing this for my cell phone now. They took away my GoPro and my passport. I had to leave it at the front. Okay, so the word to the wise, you cannot bring in an actual camera. You can bring in your cell phone. You can take all the pictures, all the video that you want, but no cameras. So my GoPro, my passport, and our entire trip is documented. It's sitting at the front gate with the guard. So I'm hoping it's pretty secure by so We'll see, hopefully I can go home tonight. Hopefully my passport is still there. Okay, so he's far away, but you can see him right over there. The lion and the lioness just to the left. So evidently they are black lions because they have black names. With the dog. So yeah, there is a ton of construction that are going to be set up for some tourism when this is all over with. Nice view overlooking the beach. Okay, so that's the princess's bedroom. Council of Ministries, Princess Bedroom. Yeah. Okay, so this is the throne where.
So I'm assuming this is the banquet hall that we're going to next. Okay, so we saw it earlier where you saw the guards up there amongst all those buildings. It's Menelik's Palace and it's closed off. It's only available for the VIPs. That's where Abi lives. So all this stuff's pretty incredible to see. In the basement, there's, it goes through the whole history of the Red Terror. Um, Ethiopia's been through a lot and to be there, right there where it happened, is pretty incredible to see. Okay, so uh, yeah, camera's still there. Got my passport, which is good news. Thank you. Anyways, pretty awesome sight.